tough one. R one thirty four A. I was hoping this was gonna be national brand. I got this from Advanced Auto. Hundred and three dollars after buying it online, picking it up in store. I was hoping it was gonna be national. Like I said, they have the same number, but it's a tough one. Even though that's just an Advanced Auto name. But where did they get this from? There's been a whole a lot of talk and problems with Chinese R134A. It's mixed with a bunch of other stuff, flammable stuff. Um, yeah, R122, R12 is mixed into it. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything on the box. That does, that code does match the tank. The WC, whatever, whatever, whatever. It's on here. Same number. Sam's Club also sells this stuff too, but with the price I got this for, it's like about equal. It's not far off from Sam's Club is far away. But I'm not seeing anything that's suspicious about this container. I think it's safe. I'm reading up on the internet that some of this stuff too has like trash in it. Which could screw up my apparatus. I don't know. What do you guys think about this? Anyone new about Chinese refrigerant? Anyone ever used this advanced total of tough one stuff? Probably refrigerant. But I just hope it's not made overseas. I saw that, I got scared, but I said, let me go get it anyway. Maybe I'll post up my other video with the whole um, shenanigans to get this. I was kind of ranting, going crazy again. Just because it's this kind of place. And every time you learn to do the littlest thing, someone's got to break your balls. About it. Yeah, I'm not really seeing nothing on this. Box is made in uh, 12 of uh, 14, so it's been sitting around. Watch packaging. Plenty of Ohio. Nothing. China. Not in the box. Don't they have to label stuff that's Chinese these days? I think it's like USA law. What do you think? Good, bad? I've seen some people when they charge the system, the tank is upside down. Now I'm thinking it's upside down because that would be liquid. Right? You want liquid refrigerant when you're charging something up. But the tank says. Wait, a minute, what does the tank say? This way up. Okay, this ended up for vapor. All right, that makes sense. This end down for liquid vapor. Okay, this end down. This end down. I should say this end down. No, this end. I don't know. It doesn't make sense. It should say something different. Get this. See arrow going up. This end up for vapor, okay. Boom. This end down for liquid vapor. It's gonna be pointing either which way. You can turn it either which way. It doesn't make a difference because if this way is down, you now if that way is facing down, it's going to be. I should say this end down. It would be liquid vapor, but the arrow is pointing this way. So this arrow should actually be up. Should you up, down? I don't get this, but shouldn't this thing be upside down? When you charge it, would that be liquid? Please someone explain that to me. I believe it is. I believe the last time I used the machine too, it was that way as well. So that's my other question. But that's it, that's the tank. Uh, Take good care of the tank because the tank brings us coolness in a hot area, in a hot garage. How are you, young y'all refrigerant company LTD? Contact not Mr. Wong, Mr. Mika. Oh, email sales refrigerant gas China.com. Yeah, where's it made? I'll show you. 
Yo, how are you featuring Cole LTD is located in Kusa, Zai Lang, which is the capital of Fion in China and the number of port, Shanghai port.